All right, what's up, gamers? We're back with more Neptunia on the PS3. The PS3. PS3. I never, I never, I can never resist making that stupid joke, even though it's been like four years since I started making that joke. But anyways, guys, we gotta find the key fragments. We're still stuck on that. Just non-stop find the key fragments. Anyways, we might finish up in Last Station today, because I don't think there's actually really anything for us to do here. For our goddess, there's some, like, optional dungeons. But, I was thinking we'd head over, head on over to Louis. Because, that's, I actually have stuff I can do there. So, let's go to Louis. Um, oh yeah, I have to, I have to search. <laughs> So why do people not like this mechanic of waiting for the plant of like waiting for the lands to come towards you? Maybe I'm just misremembering people com actually complaining about this because I don't really have a problem with it. The only thing I really have a problem with is like the fact you have to go through the same dungeon every time and just walk there. And you know, you have to get into an unnecessary encounter on the way there. All's well that ends well. But that's about it. That's my only real complaint. Other than that, it's pretty chill, honestly. But these guys are really easy now, so it's not like it really matters much. Penguin land. And yeah, now, if you can just take care of this guy. Yep. Perfect. Easy. Anyways, um, what's something I can talk about during this stream? Because I haven't- I've had a severe lack of interesting conversations recently. Hmm. I mean, I am kind of glad that I'm only doing, like, one series at a time now. Because it allows me to just, you know, focus. It allows me to just focus on this game and nothing else. So, like, I'm technically not doing one game at a time, though, because I'm also doing, like, Tomodachi Life on the side, but that's- I just do that whenever I don't have enough time to play Neptunia. So, like, if I only have, like, an hour or, like, 50 minutes of time, I just play Tomodachi Life instead, because that's also pretty easy to boot up and just play for a little bit. But then with this game, I kind of like to play, you know, for, like, an hour and a half to, like, three hours at a time, anywhere from- <laughs> anywhere from that. So, yeah. The group visits another town to annihilate some monsters. According to IF, the town is a city ruled by guild extremists. Look at the funny the mushroom background. It's all tense. Is this the extremist side of Guild City? Looks the same to me. Shut it! There are extremists and moderatists within the guild. I'm a moderatist. What's the difference between an extremist and a moderatist? They're both guild members, right? Yeah, please answer that for me. <laughs> Simple. Moderatists focus on worshipping, while extremists despise the other goddesses they don't believe in. Oh. Oh, okay. <laughs> what happens if you believe in a goddess they don't? I hear you die. Get shot until your body's mm. a fishing net, or they'll flame you on website forums for being a fanboy. You get shot? Wow. You know what? This could be a, this could be a good screenshot. Are you cute little things here to fight monsters or us? How brave of you! Oh, there. I love how you can just tell it's Michelle Ruff's voice. There's just some VAs where, like, you can easily just tell, like, oh, yep, yeah, that's them. <laughs> there are monsters in the forest ahead. They're pretty violent, so do whatever you want with them. Then again, I'm so used to her voicing, like, Yukari Takeba. So I'm so more I'm more used to like the high pitched, you know, kind of voice, but she's she, when she voices in this game, she's got like this gruff tone that like Nisa has, for example. I'm not really used to that. 
Uh, oh, hang on. We got Patrol Bounty. I mean, I, oh, that's a Planet Neptune. We have not been to Planet Neptune in so long. Is there anything even in Planet Neptune? Planet PR. And World's Labyrinth. Alright, that's optional. Alright, Blonnie, what do you have to say about Planet PR? Actually, you know what? I'm gonna bother Zeppi and tell him that, um... I'm gonna tell him that Blonde is on screen. I'm going to- I'm going to Louis. <laughs> yep. Yeah. I want to talk about the island surrounding Louis. I don't know who built the stupid thing, but there's some ship. A stone tower and a cave are also out there. <laughs> One's called the Cave of Dragons. You'll find it if you go there. That does not sound like something you'd find in the Wii. <laughs> it sounds more like a lean box thing. Even experienced adventurers barely make it back alive. Civilians should definitely stay away. But if yep. you want to push your limits, feel free to try. I see blonde, but an ad ruined it. Ah, damn it, ads. I plan to go there soon. So if you're lucky, maybe you'll run into me. I love how every time the like the ads just happen at like the worst possible time. I really need to fix that the, the ad break problem. I think I need I think I think like Twitch said it too extreme or something. I need to tone it down. So we're gonna go to the Guild Extremist City then. And hope maybe we'll see Blonde after this, who knows? I'll put my mic a little closer. We got more snowy dungeon. I hope we'll find something nice. Okay, I guess we're going this way first. I'm guessing it's over there. Back <laughs> off. Don't waste your yeah, I'll, I'll, I, I gotta tone it down. You know, I'm gonna write that down before I forget because I always forget shit. Own down Twitch ads because Twitch is really aggressive recently. Like one time Elijah told me he got like fucking 12 ads. Like what the fuck? <laughs> Alright. Hmm. What enemy? Goomba go Goombario. My turn's not over yet. There we go. Because I to be fair, I was just I'm just using default Twitch settings, but it seems even those are too aggressive. This is our true power. I want all I want all those. Give me that. So Ready to go treasure hunting. Wait. Where, so, yeah, it is over there, like I thought. I'm probably skipping something important. Yeah, I could have gone that way, but whatever. I'm mostly going to be going at... Ch change it to low. Yeah, I'll do that. Ooh, a chest. I want that later. Look pretty weak. <laughs> Love this dramatic-ass music. Hey, these guys don't really do that much. I mean, they do a bit, but it's not nothing too crazy, honestly. Sure, I'll transform. Oh, I'm out of, uh, I'm out of AP. <laughs> Compa's not really gonna get to attack until, like, bosses. No problem at all. Come back anytime. <laughs> Is this the stream where someone actually joins the party? I don't know. I guess we'll find out. I I I'm just- I'm just be happy if anybody joins at this point. Cause I think- I think this is the longest- Nep I think this is the Neptune game where you go the longest without extra party members. 
kind of wild, honestly. Because, like, if this was Rebirth 1, I would have had, like, Noir and Burt by now, and probably Blonde, too. But, nope, not in this game. Let's get him in a single turn. And I have all the DLC, so there's no reason why I shouldn't have any extra characters. So, yeah. This is our true power. These guys don't get much experience, so I'm just kind of going through the story at this point. What level am I, actually? That's not the menu. We're, uh... 21 and 18. Ready to go treasure hunting? I'm not sure what the I'm not sure what an end game level could look like. Typically in Neptune games, they go up to like 60s and 70s. But I don't know what this game's end game level is gonna be. We'll find something nice. Alright, anything good? Awesome! Yeah, just some gelatins. Which I've not really used much of. How am I doing on, um, items, actually? I haven't really had to worry about items too much recently. I mean, especially because I have 8,000 credits. 80 to 100. I guess we'll see, because I actually don't know. Usually, like, 90 to 100 gel- or, like, re reflexes is pretty good. Considering a normal heal now only costs 4. Five reflexes, so that basically means I got 18 heals. And that's if I don't get any reflexes. Also, crab, crab battle. Yeah, I'll transform again. Why not? Maybe I. I don't think I'm killing this thing. Oh no! Oh, what the fuck? Why did it do so much? Why did that happen? What the fuck? This one is appropriate. Why did it do this so much? Jesus. This... It's a tough ass enemy. Combo, combo just can't catch a break. That didn't hurt. It's crab battle. This one is. Jeez, man. Why? Why do so much? Now, now combo's gonna need to heal again. <laughs> That was rough. What the fuck? I, I can't believe I had such a hard time. Well, okay, why do those guys like like, like twenty four hundred experience? Why is there just randomly like strong ass enemies mixed in with these weak ass ones? Not bad. I'm a break it. Hmm, Kampu, what can we have you do? I have her set the special drink C, so... We'll see. I'm trying to get out of this dungeon. I think the exit's over here. Mr. Krabs in the game. <laughs> yeah, we we're, uh... We're not doing too good. Here's the problem, right? Kampa never gets to move before enemies do. So... She, she's very rarely gonna ever get to heal, unless I can kill this wyvern. <laughs> okay. Can I have Iffy heal herself? Your potion I upon switching. This one only works if she has 15% or less. Big green grass. Oh, if he has a um a full heal now. You know what? That might not be a bad idea. I'd have to set that to her next battle though. Do that. Mm -hmm. Okay, I want to I want to have Kampa defend so she can heal up. The power of medicine is immeasurable. There. 
All right, she's she's fine. <laughs> she she Kampa's actually living now. <laughs> She won't die instantly anymore. Which is all I care about, really. Come on, we've got this. Oh, sick. Easy peasy. Perfect. That's exactly what I needed. <laughs> all right, now we can switch it back. Mmm. Yeah, let's do that. Does Kampa have any new item skills? No, he has first aid, that's about it. Neptune has a lot of it as well. Protein. Applies lunatic effect? What the fuck is the lunatic effect? Guess what they need, dude. Oh, yeah, here's the boss. Good thing I, good thing I did heal, then. So there is no exit. I gotta go be defeat the mo the boss. It's like one of those weird frog things. I think I can handle this monster myself. It's a tadpole. I don't know what the fuck these things are even supposed to be, because they're definitely not frogs, I can tell you that. <laughs> Gives you harder enemies to fight. <laughs> Good one. Oh, if I just had one more AP. Oh yeah, let's try out Quick Shot. A perfect target. That did not do as much as I thought it would. This attack will hurt. Boom. At least the game is not completely brain dead with the difficulty. Like it, it, it can kind of catch you off guard sometimes. This guy's probably gonna die in like two turns. Oh, we broke his guard, dude. Nice. Oh. How can oh boy. 540 and paralyze. Not bad. This is a good time. Yeah, that's pretty annoying. One thousand, that's not bad actually. I've got this. All right. Ding. Oh, that's definitely some damage. <laughs> there, there comes another green grass. Wow, we're almost out of reflexes already. That's crazy. How much is that? How much of that? How much of that paralysis is actually gonna kick in? Boom. At least I'm that gives me a combo blink. I won't miss my target. The paralysis didn't really kick in much. <laughs> yeah, this guy is basically dead. But Cerno, oh, I can't even use Cerno. All right, let's shoot at him. Perfect aim. <laughs> He's dead from a gun. Let me know if you need my treatment. Stuffed frog. Wait, twenty-five experience? Why? <laughs> Why so little? <laughs> what the fuck? Okay. Oh yeah, you know what? We can check our um. Event completion 29%. Wait, we've only beaten 29% of this game? <laughs> what the fuck? How? That's kind of wild. Okay. Ruler of a snowy forest. The team gets a bounty request from Louise Central Basilicom. The party heads to a forest where a nasty troll has taken residence. Oh, is it Seb? Is Seb there? Hello. I'm here to represent the Basilica and explain your bounty job. May it is back. Not the usual three today, huh? Something's different. 
Who's missing? It's in your head. Kampa, Iffy, and me. Everything's the same. Are you the new one? Oh. That's <laughs> right. Little Neptune is missing. Did she sleep in? Oh, God damn it. My fucking soundboard played out of my TV again. What is this, like, the 40, 43rd time? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> when the find the key fragment Well, That's what I want to know. There we go. <laughs> is she okay? Or did she get sick? Did she get knocked out of the party rotation? <laughs> Where's Padme? Is she alright? <laughs> I get it. Monster fighting is serious. You shouldn't keep the weak links on her front line. Well, that's just rude. N no! This is nep, nep It's kind of a long story, but she's transformed into her more developed self, so to speak. Her, uh, mature transformation. Don't worry about it. Can you hurry and explain the job? People are facing danger as we speak. Yes. The forest is infested with monsters. We'd like you to go clear them out. Some raid residential districts in search of food. It's starting to trouble the civilians. Sound like some ill-mannered monkeys. I bet they're hungry. Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. If you can't say that. <laughs> if, if you can't say that. <laughs> Probably the Neptune planet. If he is racist, confirmed. <laughs> okay, I guess we're going to another forest. Just, just no. Actually, you know what? Hang on. Before I go there, uh, 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 hold on. I might buy something before I go. Uh, let's see. Do they have anything new in the shop? Um, rune armlet for Neptune. Well, hang on, though. That's gonna lower my HP. Oh, yeah, we already bought that for, um... Oh, the Suspicious Bangle. 2,000. I think that's better than the Energy Bracelet. I might buy that, honestly. For, um... Neptune. Yes, find the key fragments. We'll buy one of these. And I think we're all good on armor after that. Still, I don't think anything compares to that youth bandage that Iffy got. Oh yeah, I can also buy um some accessories for Iffy if I really want. Anyways, uh, I'm just gonna stock up on reflexes as one does. There we go. All good. Actually, buy eight more. There we go. Now I'm ready. Because that's pretty much the only item I really need to buy is reflexes, because I don't use the other ones very much. Alright, now we can do, um, Monster Forest. We gotta find the key fragments, guys. Honestly, though, the more I play this game, the more I realize the graphics have honestly aged pretty well. <laughs> Boss's wood sword? Yo, is that better than what I have? Oh shit, it is. And it doesn't even lower my magic attack either. I mean, yeah, it's a fucking wooden sword, which is lame, but it gives you more attack. Sick. Oh yeah, and let me give, um... Let me put the, um... Okay, so how much increase does it give me? For 1540... To 1940 and 2090. Yeah, that, that's definitely an upgrade. What does the others do? The other the other swords, you mean, or what? <laughs> Alright, we need Ify to figure out where the treasure is. Ready to go treasure hunting? Where is that? Where, where am I supposed to go? Oh, I'm supposed to go straight? Okay. So I don't think it really matters which way I go. No, the medicine? Oh, oh. Boom. Well, they do do stuff. Let me show you. So, for example, if we look at Neptune's skills. For example, the EX Netball. Not only does it cause reflexes, but it also requires 15 gelatins. And, um... The stuff that cures statuses require detoxins. And the really expensive stuff, like Happy Potion... 
Th that requires tough mills. So, like, the more expensive, like, the more, like, boss related, like, items that I would use, those require the more expensive ones. I think I accomplish the same way. Yeah, like, a revive kit is 30, 20, and 10. And the first aid kits also requires 10 gelatins and 10 tough mills. So, the thing is, they, it do, does require a lot, but you're not using those as often, because you only need to use them in very specific no, situations. Alright, we have the Ice Fenrir. Target locked. That's definitely Wake to Fire. Heavy. Oh, he's dead already. What the fuck? That was easy. Let's keep the peace in game industry. Okay, yeah, now now they're now, now we're only getting like 200 experience. It's better medicine, yeah. Okay, look at that. Actually, I got a bunch of each of them actually. Like you, since you're forced to do random encounters and the enemies drop items anyways. You're pretty much never gonna have to buy them, pretty much. Like, unless you really run out of them and you need to heal. A oh, see, like, I got three more reflexes from the chest. We're better than this. And also, I always do treasure. I always do treasure search, so I always get, um... I always get, like, a bunch of stuff from those chests, too. Wow. <laughs> do, 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 do. Okay, yeah, these battles are pretty easy. <laughs> well, and the reason why... The reason why these encounters are so easy is because I did a bunch of the d harder dungeons in Last Station. So since I did all the hard dungeons in Last Station, these, these feel really easy now. <laughs> Oh, yeah, and also, according to Iffy, there is a treasure around here. I hope we'll find something nice. It's uh, over that way. Okay. I'm a break it. Now I just gotta find out where the treasure spawns. I wonder what kind of items are here. Mm, oh, it's over there. Okay. I actually find the treasure search pretty fun. I wonder what kind of items are here. All right, well, I got in here. See, it's always nice when the treasure is actually like equipment, but otherwise it's just like a bunch of medicine. Oh wow, twenty reflexes. How many do I have now? One one hundred three. Yep, now I'm good on reflexes for a while. When I say a while, I mean like maybe one or two dungeons. We have the rock worm. All right, are you weak to ice? Are you weak to wind then? Okay, this guy's a bit more tanky than the other enemies. Oh no, he did 700 damage to me. <laughs> Good thing uh, Iffy is so damn powerful. Alright, he's dead. That's gotta be get some good experience, right? Easy. Who's next? No, okay, just 250 still. We're not getting like any experience. If he has the power of summoning treasures with light. Yeah, pretty much. I mean We need like 5,000 more experience to get a level, and these guys are only giving me like 250, so I'm not gonna get any levels. So lame. <laughs> Actually, I probably should just keep Neptune out, because I already got the treasure in this dungeon. Because as far as I know, there can only be one hidden treasure per dungeon. I can take care of this alone. And that's something that's something that they've um That's something that they've had in every Neptunia game. They've always had like hidden treasures. That's just that's just a that's a mechanic that they they just love using over and over again. These guys are really easy. They die in like three hits. I wish nursing school was this easy. 110 experience. No, that's like nothing, dude. What the fuck? I might have to go to one of those optional dungeons if I actually want to level up. Get more money that way. We can get more money. Alright, this guy shouldn't be that hard. I'll make all of 
of you proud. To be fair, the t the dungeon completion rate might also be based on the optional ones too. So we'll see. All right, let's 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 watch. Let's actually watch Neptune's transformation again. I always like to watch at least once per episode. <laughs> it's kind of a tradition. I mean, to be fair, in Sailor Moon, the, the sit-up animation. I mean, to be fair, when I watch Sailor Moon, I never skip the transformation sequences. I watch them every single time, because they're just that good. <laughs> Same goes for Neptunia. I have just enough for Penguin Land. Wow. Might even kill this guy in one fucking turn if I'm lucky. Nah, I'm not killing him in one turn. Got pretty close, though. Ow, jeez. Alright, Kompa, time to take him down. Here's a strong one. Poke. Uh, oh, next one is... There we go. If Kompa had better speed, we could have done that in one turn. Marshall B. Right. Level up. Hey, we actually got a level up from that. Good. Nice. Um, 93 AP now. And we have... We got 100 HP. Yeah, some good stats all around. Only Neptune got a level up, interestingly. She's coming. I feel it. She's coming. Aura is similar it's coming, it's coming. Oh shit! We meet again. Why heart? You'll not escape from me this time. How rude! It's not a coincidence. Look at your wife been stalking Nep Nep this whole time. So, it's a figure of speech. Does it really matter? Why is it playing the Planet Neptune bet boss theme? <laughs> It'll be different now. I'm not letting you go, Neptune. Oh boy, whatever. I guess I have some time. Whiteheart might kick my ass. I don't know yet. I, 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 I'm kind of scared. Blonde is nice. Whiteheart is ammo. Blonde is nice. I see. Yes, yeah, so we're gonna watch the transformation again because it's another important Going boss fight. Plus, it gives you more time to hear the Whiteheart boss theme. Alright, let's see how this goes. Oh, fine. If I can put them in check. Kinda tickle. Bang, bang, bang. See now we actually have enough AP to do an extra attack there. <laughs> Alright, I, I, I don't know. I'm, I'm curious how much damage she'll do. We'll see, I guess. Perfect. <laughs> Frick! Oh, just barely can't do it enough. Another one. Uh-oh, Kampa. Deep shot. I won't forgive you, even if you cry. Okay, Com Compa's okay. She's okay. <laughs> Although I might want to defend with her just in case. I think I can keep going. All right, let's defend with Compa because she <laughs> she's she's been doing he's been dying a lot recently, which is not good. Normally, I expect Iffy to be the one to die, but no, uh, Compa has been dying a lot. Oh, kind of tickled. I'll shoot if you don't leave. I'm fine. Bang, bang, bang. Star break, bitch. 
Mm -mm 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 -mm. I'll go as much. Have some good damage. A deep shot. Ow, Jesus. Holy fuck. Okay. Now's the time. That's not good. Getting a bit reckless here. Getting better. A perfect target. Correct. <laughs> That's always satisfying. The guns. This, this, this song is this song is a jam. I think I can keep going. Yeah, just keep doing that. All right, defend. I need to defend with Purple Heart too. Compass falling off like a generic Fire Emblem character. Oh no. Oh yeah, oh yeah, here comes Pac-Man. If I can put them in check. Correct! Ooh, 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 that's some good damage. Alright, defend. Even though she might be dead here. We'll see. Yeah, she's dead. We'll get you back, you little shit! <laughs> That wasn't enough to take me down. 8,000 experience! Holy fuck. Good, that's a good level up right there. Level up! She got Mio. Mew? Mew. Mo? How do you say that? That was pretty easy, actually. <laughs> she got to attack like one Hell? or two times. This is the second. How could I lose? There always be next time. We're gonna fight- I think we're gonna fight every CPU she's three persistent. times. Despite looking fragile, she's pretty tough. He's one tough customer, as they say. So we fought Whiteheart again. Interesting. Not what I was expecting this episode. Do -do 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 -do. Um... Planet PR. Way of Faith. And the Tower of Monsters. A townsperson submits a bounty request. This time the target is a gold dragon holed up in a tower. Okay. Let's talk about the planet PR culture. Hi. Let's discuss Louis again. Like I said, there's a lot of snow. I'm sick of it. But I guess some good stuff comes with having snow. First, snow festivals. We make ice statues and put them everywhere. It sounds childish, but it's fun. Second, cuddling with cats in a warm room all day. So cute. Blonde being based? <laughs> Third, is a secret. Come visit if you're curious. That's it. Okay, I'm, I'm visiting right now. Let me in. <laughs> uh, alright, alright, uh, ear, uh, audio warning again, guys. Actually, it might just be an audio warning for me. <laughs> mm. We're taking messages from our listeners. I'll read them here and carry on the messages whoever they want. Uh, I think I, I think this is the same every time, so let me just skip that. This one's from the screen name Kurohako, a last station resident. Good evening, 5PB. I'm writing to say thanks to the people who saved our town from tadpole monsters the other day. Thanks a bunch. I never knew there were tadpole monsters. I wonder if they grow up and become froggies. Well, I guess that's not too pleasant to imagine. Looks like it's time for me to go until later. Okay. When are we gonna meet 5PB? We haven't even met her yet. She, like, we've only listened to her fucking radio. Mm. <laughs> Would it be a good idea to go to Planet Tune, I wonder? Braga Tower. Alright, we're going to Braga Tower, I guess. Alright, dungeon time. This is a real dungeon. So how, big the, how big is this dungeon? Alright, my question is, where is the treasure at? 
It is... North, okay. I like I like the, I like all the music. <laughs> we gotta find the fragments, guys. It's kind of like um, it's kind of like follow the damn train, CJ. But it says fall find the damn fragments, Neptune. Hey, isn't that um, isn't that uh, Edelgard's last name? <laughs> it looks like it. I remember her having like a weird fucking name that I can't pronounce. Oh wow, look at this, look at this sneaky chest just sitting in the corner. It's close, oh. <laughs> Yay, more reflexes. What the fuck is this? Boom. It just explodes. Alright, Iffy, where is the treasure at? I hope we'll find something nice. Uh, it's close. Wait, so where is it then? Is it is it which way is it? Ready to go treasure hunting? Okay, it's over there. Well, I don't know about you, but I'm gonna go this way. Well, that ends well. Oh, these little gremlin guys. That kind of remind me of those weird ass enemies in, um. Why are they called Revenants? This isn't fucking Doom 2. Well, at least they die really, really easily. Oh, you guys get one attack off. You're lucky. Perfect. My sleeves are too long. If he keeps blinding me, <laughs> keep the peace in game industry. Boom. Mm -hmm. All right, there's got to be something good over here. Probably like an enemy or something. What the shit is that enemy? What is that? The Bean? Beanie? Beanie? Beanie the science guy? Well, I don't know, but it's dead. Alright, oh, okay, thanks for paralyzing me. You're really- you think you're really funny, huh? Yeah, I think it's, I think I'm just gonna have to sec the fact that Iffy's magic actually just sucks. She her magic attack sucks really badly, and Compa's the magic user of this game. I'm just gonna have to accept that fact, even though I'm so used to like it's just. I think I can keep it's been drilled into my brain that Iffy is like one of the best magic users, but not in this game. She sucks. She's just physical only, this is our true power. which is really awkward. Yeah, there is a treasure up here. It's gonna be like a mimic. Obtained item. Nope, just just four reflexes. Oh, and I missed an item. Two detoxins. I think I can handle this monster myself. So I talked. So I talked about it last night on Zach's rando stream, but. I was planning on, um, doing, like, a joke randomizer run for Paper Mario, where basically I, um, I basically don't sp try to get a PB, instead I just do something silly, which is not something I've done much. <laughs> I kind of want to try that, try that out, because it's been a while since I've done, like, a gimmick seed, because I don't like to do those, because I try to, I just want to keep trying to go for the PB. But every now and then it could be nice to have a run where you just kind of chill and just do something, you know, fun for a change instead of just taking party. it seriously. Also, if he has like one weird like 
like chin polygon that just keeps sticking out of her. I don't know why that happens. Probably, probably something wrong with my settings, but it's not a big enough deal that, um, like I'm gonna lose sleep over it. I hope we'll find something nice. Okay, we're getting close to the treasure. I think I have an idea on where it is. All's well that ends well. Yeah, and if he's gonna blind you again. <laughs> I hate that these guys get so. These guys have so much damn speed. So annoying. At least I can kill them in one turn with Nep Nep. Easy. Ooh. More stuff to grab. Okay, if I had to guess, the treasure's gonna be over this way, right? I wonder what kind of items are here. Yep, it's over there, okay. It's like a, it's like a weird compass. So I had to guess, it's probably just gonna be like down here. Look pretty weak. Die bat. God damn it. <laughs> now uh, comp is gonna need to heal. Oh no, my hundred reflexes. <laughs> All right, getting better. We did it! A complete victory! I want all that stuff. I wonder what kind of items are here. All right, there we go. Found it. It's gonna be like more medicine, probably. Yep. Psych. <laughs> that always makes me laugh. <laughs> Psych. I'm very easy to impress. <laughs> Pleased to meet you. Yeah, hello, Mr. Hello, Mr. Edelgard, uh, dragon wa wyvern thing. How are you doing today? I wanted to play this game yesterday, but Easy. yesterday was a surprisingly busy day because we played we played Mod Soku in the morning. I did a Mario RPG rerun, which doesn't really count, but I did stream that. Um, played um, pretty sure we played. What did we actually? What else did we do yesterday? Um, I'm gonna need to check my diary, because I don't remember. Oh yeah, I played Tomodachi Life in the morning, that's right. And then at the in the ending of the day, Mod Soka was in the morning. No, that was in the afternoon. My bad. Yeah, and then, um... So I played... Oh, that's same time. So I played Tomodachi in the morning, and then Mario What's RPG. There? Coming all this way. <laughs> How was they wanted to be Are late? You the Overlord's messenger? You finally come to kill me! Now we got the crazy old man again. So, Tomodachi in the morning, then a Mario RPG rerun, then Jose and Zeppi played Maz Soku, and then Paper Mario Randomizer at nighttime. So, it was a pretty, pretty, pretty eventful day, I'd say. No, 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 no! We're just here to beat up some monsters. Are you, um, a heretic? It's, it's more like Jose just decided to sleep in, because he always does that. He... He, um, he has graveyard shifts, so he's usually, um, working, like, you know, 10 p.m. to, like, 6 in the morning or whatever, and then he just sleeps all day, so that's why. <laughs> Get away! I've done everything I was told to! Huh? Oh, you're not? Never mind. It's like, it's like, just it's like as typical old, old man voices it gets. How'd you find out about this place? How'd you even get here? By defeating monsters, of course. How about you? Are you trapped? Defeating monsters? How dare you! You've <laughs> wasted all my efforts. I better prepare myself. You killed the beasts. The Overlord's messenger will arrive in no time to deliver punishment to us all. Oh no. Because we fought monsters? Is it bad to do that sort of thing here? 
Ain't no way, man. Monsters <laughs> are baddies. They attack people and break stuff for no reason. So what? That's a great alternative to destroying the world. No time to waste. I gotta get out then of there's here. There's no time to waste. Everything's going to be over once the messenger learns about this. Not the messenger, however that is. Stop! Let us take care of that messenger. Pass. Don't involve me <laughs> in your sins, or I'll get killed too. Please do not follow me. Pass. What you think this is? A disc? We get this sort of thing from treasure chests, but this one's kind of different. There are more. Oh, 43 times. Give that to me. Don't touch it. Whoopsie daisy. I stepped on it. I'm sorry, <laughs> but it's totally your fault for pushing me. <laughs> Neptune broke the disc. <laughs> oh, look, something came out of it. You broke the disc and it malfunctioned. But wait, is that the same monsters we fight all the time? What the fuck? There's monsters inside discs? What the hell? Pretty mysterious Neptune of love and justice. In the name of the Basilicom, I'll punish you. The light dragon. That is not a golden dragon, bro. What the hell? And yes, ne Neptune just casually dropping a Sailor Moon joke again. I'm pretty sure the wiki even mentions that. Probably. Well, I ran out of tea, so I gotta drink my juice now. Juice always tastes really weird after drinking tea, though. Sit up. Sit up. Sit up. Oh, I gotta, oh, I gotta find moment ready. Sit up. <laughs> I, I don't think you heard it. I tried playing the vine boom. I think it was like too. I think it was too quiet. <laughs> Sit up. Go Penguin Land. All right, getting better. This will be powerful. See how much I think wind might be the way to go for the dragon. It's either wind or earth. Both are pretty good, I remember correctly. Oh well, god. Kampa, no! Kampa, no! Well, uh, Kampa is not, once again, not getting experience, I guess. Bro, really just jumped here. What the fuck? I don't know when I saved last either, so rip. All right, it's just you and me now, Iffy. We gotta take down this dragon. I've got this. I've got this. Oh, my combo link lasted quite a while. I never let my prey. All right. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. I'm getting destroyed. What the fuck? How embarrassing. Uh, okay. I guess if he's soloing this fight, then. Did you think that was it? All right. Defend. <laughs> Make sure to defend. Oof. Uh oh. This is a good time. All right, if you really got, you really gotta win this fight now. Did you think that was it? I think I can win this, just barely. Wow, if he carried that fight. My cell phones. One of them is not broke. <laughs> <laughs> Thank God. Yay. Okay. We won, barely. I should have saved before that. We were occupied fighting the bad guys and the heretic ran away. <laughs> Fuck. 
He wanted nothing to do with us. It's pointless to go after him. We're only here to fight monsters anyway. Wow. Okay, talk about a close one. Jeez. Mm. Anything else I can buy? I don't think this is updated yet. Oh yeah, you know what I haven't done? I was gonna see if that um, processor I got was any good. What was it exactly? Marshall B. Hmm, that gives me strength and intelligence. Well, I quite like that, honestly. Look how, look how goofy my Neptune looks now. Rip Compa, yeah, I know. Well, I also got Marshall W. That is just worse in every way, though. <laughs> okay. Mm -mm -mm. Alright, well. We're doing good. Look how many moves we have. <laughs> so many. Combo will get, so Combo will get her experience up eventually, don't worry. But wait, does that mean that... I don't know, Neptune still has more experience than Iffy. Wait, no, if no, Iffy does have more experience than Neptune now. So Iffy's gonna be leveling up before Neptune now. <laughs> oh, that's funny. She still has the youth bandage, because that, that's just really good. Alright, um, World's Labyrinth F2. Warm Room and Tangerines. Oh, great. More Tangerine talk from Blani. Eating tangerines in a warm, firelit room on a cold day is awesome. Don't you agree? Thanks, Blon. Alright, another attacker. While the party continues to fight monsters, the hands of the Overlord begin to cast shadows over a game industry. Well, that's, that sounds pretty serious. How much moon need? I have 17,000? Oh, wait, 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 wait. New weapon for Compa? The Gigatoxin. Okay, I'll buy that. No new armor, though. But, she's got a new weapon. Hey, I mean, I'll take anything at this point. Yeah, that's still worse than what she has on. Yeah, I guess to be fair, if he's not dying much, because I put the suspicious bangle on her, right? Or the youth bandage, rather. So, 1,000 to 1,270. Gives her a 400... No, gives her like a 350 magic attack increase. And a 300 attack increase. A comp is stronger now, yay! Oh, okay, we got an event, so I'm gonna save then before that. I've saved like three times. Boring, man. <laughs> oh shit, is R4 here? <laughs> I finally found you. Yeah, I, I I knew the minute I heard that music, I was like, oh fuck. <laughs> Whoa, another stalker. What's up with your laugh? Seriously, what do you want? Right, you wouldn't remember. I am the notorious Overlord Momus's messenger. Oh, R four is the messenger. Your act is a grievous sin against the great Overlord. <laughs> You'll go no further until you face your punishment. I thought she was about to say your ass is a grievous sin. <laughs> Oh, we were just- we were just fighting R4? Okay. Just no- no fucks to give? We're just fighting her. And it's playing her boss theme. What's this? This gun's heavy! I mean, her, her boss theme goes hard, though. Oof. Some good damage there. We'll see how tough, uh, we'll see how tough she is. Alright, I'm gonna defend. What the hurt. fuck? Ouch. 
Hang in there, Compa. This would have sold for a good price. Let's heal quick so it doesn't spar. Not off to a good start, are we? And does Ify have a way to heal um, poison? He does have an antidote. Here's tent poison and restores 10% of everyone's health. Yeah, I might actually put that on right now. Alright. I can tell R4 is not gonna be. He's not gonna pull any p punches. Warrior Coliseum guy, hell yeah. I never let my prey. Alright, and we defend now. Yeah, now and our combo's doing way more damage. Now's my chance to attack more. There, there, there. Oh. Oof, that is some good damage, actually. All right. Yeah, guard break. Yeah, just keep, just keep attacking her. Go, Gumbario! <laughs> oh, I need to see him. Here I come. Yeah, Gumbario! <laughs> Hell yeah. I'll go as much as I can. Alright, now we defend. Oof. Ow. Yeah, that, that's... Yeah, that's definitely smart. I won't hesitate to use more. Well, hang on a minute. So, Antidote only has a 50-50 chance to activate, right? So, we gotta... It might take a little bit for, act for it to actually kick in. Alright, getting... Getting better. I mean, that does a lot of, more like, guard point damage. Yeah, like, we, we actively have to defend at the end of every turn and calculate, like, how much AP we have left. One more. I love that Dual Edge gives combo length when you're already transformed, which is really nice. Ow. Keep fighting. Yep, keep going. You gotta live. Or maybe she can only activate one spell at a time. Wait, 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 hang on, hang on. When it's Compa's turn, um Can we have Compa activate first aid kit next turn? He might actually activate it, because if I remember correctly, it's just, uh, yeah, upon action. She, she is gonna activate that when we get to her turn. Which is good. Did you think that was it? Yeah, here we go. Perfect. We need, we really need this. <laughs> Okay, good. Now we can put it back to first aid and maybe special drink too. Emergency care. Might not be bad actually, because she's probably going to get to level low 30% anyway, right? The thing is, I don't know if Kamba's going to be able to survive. <laughs> Mm. All right, let's defend again. Yeah, because if a combo gets hit twice, she's dead, which really would suck if that happened. I 
if I do remember correctly, there is an R4 fight, like, in the middle of the game in, um, Rebirth 1, so this is sort of, this is sort of, um, it's sort of accurate to this then, huh? Go, Penguin Land. <laughs> okay, now I gotta defend. Okay, good. She attacked Neptune. Not yet. Oh, she got afflicted with poison again. This is a good time. Sure is a good time. Alright, well, we're still doing fine. Yeah, maybe only maybe only one thing can happen at once. Like, how does um Yeah, antidote it happens upon damage. So for that to even kick in... Um, like, I basically... I just can't have green graph speed 100%, so it's never gonna kick in, I think. Because only one can happen at a time, I'm pretty sure. You can't have multiple effects happen at once, right? Unless I'm wrong about that. I never let my prey go. Ooh, good, good. Right, getting better. Hmm. Yeah, I have to defend again. At least that does a lot of damage. I think I can keep going. She's getting closer to dying. I'll go as much. Mmm, no, I need to do charge shot. Oh. I don't like getting Ooh, hurt. that's not good. Oh, Kampa's dead. Oh, fuck. Ouch. <laughs> Man, Kampa can really not catch a break. She just keeps dying over and over. Sucks that my healer keeps going down. Maybe I should put the youth bandage on Kampa then instead. That might be a better idea, to be honest. All right, getting better. Well, unfortunately, we can't heal with Compa anymore. One more. Oh wow. Got a guard break at just the right time too, huh? I've got this. Good stuff. Ooh. -oh. oh, she's dead. She's fucking dead. How embarrassing. Uh oh. This would have sold for a good price. I think we're dead. Well, if he gets two turns, wait, why? Why she get two turns? Is it because she's the last one alive? I don't think I don't think we're winning this. Yeah, there's no way we're winning this now. I'm basically shit out of luck. I'll get. All right, getting better. Soul combo. Yeah, I'm dead. That's gonna kill me. Come with me. Wow, she actually killed me. That's fucking crazy. Hmm. Maybe I gotta do an optional dungeon or something to get a little bit prepared for that. So we actually can't beat our four yet. Hmm. Can we do this dungeon yet? I forget if this what dungeon was too hard for us. Can we just run around real quick and see how the enemies are like in here? Spin! We are better than this. Alright, how strong are you guys? Alright, these guys aren't that bad. Turns not over yet.
Hmm. Alright, the question is, are these guys even worth my time, though? Oh, welcome back. This is our true power. Oh yeah, these guys don't give any experience. This dungeon's not worth it. No, this is really low-level dungeon uh, territory. I don't know if I feel like doing that. I'm not gonna do every dungeon. I'm too lazy for that. Okay, so what about well four two? Is that any better? Did you miss anything? Uh, you missed me getting my ass kicked by R four. <laughs> so I'm trying to I'm doing a bit of dungeon crawling so I can maybe get a little bit stronger to try and fight her. Spin. Mind over matter. Oh, these crap. Oh, it's the crap battle. These guys, these guys are more manageable. These guys give a lot of experience. Yeah, they actually, they actually do damage to me. And they give like what, like a thousand experience or something? Who the fuck is R four? Uh, she's the villain of this game. <laughs> the like the actual villain. And we, we ran into her randomly, and we had a boss fight, and I got my ass kicked because she targeted Kampa again. Which is why I'm going to switch around my equipment. I'm going to give the uh, Suspicious Bangle to Iffy, and I'm going to put the um, Youth Bandage on Kampa instead. Because Kampa really needs the defense anyway. Because, um, she kept getting targeted. <laughs> and I'm sick of Kampa dying every time. Ready to go treasure hunting? Okay. Actually, I'm pretty sure I recognize this dungeon layout. It's very similar to the one we had before. I can already see this ending. <laughs> you like Iffy more than Kampa. I mean, I know I do. Like, just fucking take your turn already, jeez. I like Iffy, but I don't want Kampa to be dying all the time, because I need her for healing. <laughs> yeah, these guys, these guys in particular are especially tanky. Or maybe Neptune's just really weak. Uh, uh Alright, come on, Nep Nep. We gotta take down this guy. Wait, you still lived? These guys are gonna give lots of experience, I know that. Did you think that there we go. Did you see me? I was oh awesome. yeah. Eleven hundred experience. That's much better. If I can get like one level up and maybe some drops from this dungeon, I'll be pretty happy with that. The bloom effects in this game are kinda nuts, honestly. So I need, like, 22,000 experience. Boom! I mean, it's the PS3. They were probably, like, really impressed with Bloom or something back in the day. What's this? I don't know. <laughs> that could be it. Is the treasure over there again? You know what it probably is. No, 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 no way! This is impossible. Wait, what the fuck is this enemy? Steel golem? 
What the fuck? This guy doesn't look that bad. <laughs> Why was Iffy freaking out over this guy? <laughs> I can probably defend regardless. Because who knows what this guy is going to do to me. Uh, um. Yeah, guard break. Uh, um. Alright, let's defend. I don't know what this guy is going to do to me. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Poor Compa, she's dead again! <laughs> How much experience is this guy gonna give, then? That wasn't bad at all. I'm just having a bad day. <laughs> that wasn't bad at all! Compa died, but whatever. Okay, uh, that's a yikes. Ready to go treasure hunting? Mm, there it is. Even when I put the the bangle didn't do shit, she still died. Papa is so fragile. I hope we'll find something nice. I found something. Snow S. Hmm. Yeah, that's that's pretty good. Probably won't make much of a difference, but it looks nice. <laughs> Every healer is fragile, true, I guess. This is gonna be tough. Combat is always on the verge of dying now, <laughs> which sucks. Probably get out of this dungeon then. Mm. Doesn't really matter who I kill first. Oh boy. Maybe I, should go, maybe I should go fight one of those optional guys instead. That might be more worth my time. Also, I'm targeting the wrong guy. Let's see if he can kill him. I never let my... Yeah, there we go. That was pretty bad. <laughs> that was pretty. You're pretty bad. This would be a, this would be a case where I wouldn't mind having one of those escape buttons so I can get out of the dungeon. I'm a break it. Compa being at one HP is never good. I hate that you just can't heal your partners in this game. That's so frustrating. Well, let's see if I can um, beat this thing. Ready to win this? Don't know though. We'll see. Labyrinth. Here's the thing, right? Should I just reload my save if he goes after Compa? Well, you can't reload in battle, that's the problem. You have to, like, actually get a game over. We'll see. It sucks that I just can't, you know, heal Kampa up. <laughs> oh, fuck. Lunatic. 
Oh, yeah, we're, we're dead. So what's the lunatic status? Is that just like, you know, ding is that like ang- what, what is that? I don't know. I guess we'll find out. I'm unsure if I'll be able to kill this guy, but we'll find out, I guess. I kind of need, um... I need the net bull. Yeah, the net bull. EX net bull right now. I'm not sure what the lunatic um, status is. Oh, does she just like randomly choose to do something else or something? Is that how that works? And she didn't even heal. Wait, what the fuck? Did I not set her to do EX Netball? Okay, weird. <laughs> Is Iffy gonna carry this battle again? Did you think that was it? She, I mean, she might, honestly. Oh. Well, that went very poorly. I'm outies. <laughs> I'm outies. <laughs> oh, I think if he's dead. Yeah, if he's dead. With me. Okay, we're not fucking doing this dungeon. That's for sure. Jesus. Screw that. We gotta find the key fragments, guys. All right, screw that. Not doing that dungeon. I kind of wish I had an escape button. That would be pretty nice. I gotta wait for- I gotta wait for, um... <laughs> my thing to charge up. I'ma break it. Oh yeah, this stage in the game, getting an escape button isn't really, uh... It's not really that much money, is it? Because we get money all the time. I still find it weird that you can only carry one of them. Lunatic doesn't allow you to heal or something. That would be really stupid. Oh, yeah. Um, could I run? I'm gonna run from that. Oh, hey, there's a chest here that I didn't get earlier. What's this? I don't usually run, but those golems kind of fucked me up. Alright, walking back out. Ready to win this? <laughs> oh, what the fuck? This loadout. I'm gonna kill this guy, because this guy absolutely destroyed me last time. And then I can try and kill the crab. The crab battle. Alright, defend, please. Now's yep. Time. Good. Good thing I did. And Compass dead again. <laughs> pretty much, uh, pretty much what you expect at this point. She can't live anything. All right, getting back. All right, we're getting out of here. <laughs> I mean, that's some experience, I guess, but wow. That's a rough dungeon. <laughs> so you have to defeat the- you have to defeat the labyrinth enemy. So I know that's not happening. You know what? Yeah, I'm gonna buy a reset button. Just on- just because I don't want something like that to happen ever again. And we still have no, um, new armor. We're stuck with whatever this is. Hmm. Well, at least I'm saving. I mean, combat not getting level up is okay. Like, I'm not 
like too worried about her falling behind because you know there's always a chance for her to catch up later so what if we go to what's floor four is that like that's like really bad isn't it um let's try this dungeon maybe <laughs> we need recruitments yeah exactly that'd be nice if more people could join our part party you know Mm, can't go that way. Well, so what, the, what are the enemies in here like, then? Oh, this is going to be tough. You never know what the enemies are going to be like until you go into a dungeon. Why? Oh, oh yeah, we're not doing this. Ah! What the fuck? This this, seriously, how am I supposed to know... What the enemies are. Like, it doesn't tell you. Okay, well, just just kill me then. I don't know. It's only over if I give up. Just look at look it up. Yeah, she's dead. I push myself too much. Those enemies are rough as well. Oh, okay, no. I know there's like a really good grinding spot somewhere though. What about um pirate ship FX? Maybe this maybe it's in here. Maybe this is a good dungeon. The lamp obtained zero of five. <laughs> oh, can't go over there yet. Take care of this alone. Crab battle. How are the enemies in here? Can Neptune take care of the king crab? Oh, oh yeah, he can. These guys are now. These guys are too easy. <laughs> we got him good. Sixty-three experience. Oh my god. The enemies are either too weak or too strong. There's no like balance. I mean, I guess I'll do this dungeon, because I've never done it before. Alright, I'll just wait. I'm a break it. Man, I haven't done this dungeon before, so I might as well do it. Oh, is this the exit or something? Oh no, that's just a dead end. Well, this is where the treasure is. If he is the treasure here. Ready to go treasure hunting? Nope, that's not where the treasure is. <laughs> Look it up on Brave and find out how to get new characters. I assume it's just with, you know, the further you get into the story, though. Like, surely if I do enough quests, I'll get another character. Oh, I'm getting more reflexes, so I can't complain with that. Well, this dungeon's pretty big. <laughs> Even though I'm getting lamps after, like, every battle. <laughs> You'll never know. But that's spoilers. I don't want to be spoiled when I get a character. I bet their experience points suck. <laughs> Neptune just casually insults the enemy. We almost, we're almost already done with this dungeon. Where's the treasure at? Ready to go treasure hunting? Oh. It's back that way. Okay, I'm too lazy then. I don't think the treasure's gonna be anything. It's probably just gonna be more medicine, honestly. Nothing in this room? We're better than this. Alright, buy lamp fish. So I mean it makes sense the lamp fish are dropping the lamps. Let's just say we're on a different level. That one didn't drop a lamp though. 
Hey, I'm getting more resources. I know it's boring seeing the same members. Oh, Nep, Nep, come on out. I'm a break it. We'll see, though. I'm trying to do as much plot as possible, because the more plot I do, the more likely I am to get a character. Oops, that's not what I meant to do. Yeah, if these guns still suck, find the damn key fragments. Yeah, wherever those are at, we'll find them. Alright, well that dungeon's done. <laughs> if he's so happy about that dungeon. Hmm. Ancient metal. That's level 7. Huh. Pretty low level now. That's all. Okay, level 700. Level 25. It tells you what dungeon is. You know, each one. Level 600. Why are they so, like, high level? 400. Um... 12. We could go to Planet Toon. We haven't been to- I wonder if anything new is in Planet- We have not visited Planet Toon in so long. I want to know what's there. to Planet Tune because I want to see if there's anything new there. <laughs> no sweat. Just, just playing this music again. Am I like super strong? Nep Nep is so strong. Oh look at all those detoxins I'm getting. It's about, it's about the experience, not the destination. Alright, I just want to see if there's anything in Planet 2 worth getting. Oh, well, I don't think we... Futuristic Fantasy. I've never seen this cutscene, actually. Ooh. Welcome. Look at the amount, the amount of effort put in this cutscene, holy shit. Well, I really forget about how, like, futuristic Planet Tune is. Land of Purple Progress. I'm gonna guess there's nothing new here. That's what a heroine is. An elderly man is cornered by a monster. It's such a hopeless situation. There's still only one who's not lost hope. Another old man. <laughs> so many heretic old men. Help! Someone! Anyone! Never thought a strong monster like this would appear so close to town. No time to waste, brah. Let's go. Bro. We got lucky the monster picked that helpless old man as its target. Yeah, brah. <laughs> him. Yeah, dude. For the team. This is new. So someone, please. Love how they ask the same dude like, hey, we have like 10 old man characters. Can you voice all of them, please? <laughs> Nisa, my girl. Who's there? 
The dashing heroine appears to save the helpless old fart. Don't worry, <laughs> oh aged one. I am here to rescue you. Heroine, huh? Hmm. She's dressed pretty provocatively. Bra! She's got no tits. Uh oh. <laughs> oh nice washboard. Or is it a cutting board? What a cruel joke. Hey there. How can you speak thusly of a heroine? Sorry. But those images just kept popping up in our heads. Oh, great. These guys are perverts. Jeez, boys. So this is the demon threatening these fair lands? I shall be your opponent today. Okay, brah. Let's bolt. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> They're just gonna dip. I forgot about the older brother and younger brother characters. That monster was a slice of easy pie. Now then, you two. How could you try to flee leaving a frail old man to be eaten? Huh? Th they're gone. <laughs> they ran off while you were fighting. Bastards. Are you hurt? No, I'm fine. Thanks to you. Saving me will make you look like my friend. Or maybe a caretaker. I don't know who you are or what you do, but I cannot ignore someone in need. Ah, she's very noble. <laughs> she got no tits. Amazing line of dialogue. <laughs> There's so many good lines of dialogue in this game. That's the call of a justice keeper. Now, Mr. Oh, Monster, 44 times. She beat us to it again. Hello, fair citizens. I decided to quell the monster threat on your behalf. Oh, we got competition, huh? Thank you. I realize I just got here, but I must go. Justice can never rest. No, come back. If we're lucky, let us meet again. Up, up, and away! Okay. Bye-bye, Miss Heroin. <laughs> Okay, she she's just gone. Uh, no, that's quest. What about the big machine? A big machine is seen on a recycling truck. Is it antique furniture? Nope, it's a jukebox. A big truck? Is it recycling day? There's something funky on it. Looks kind of like furniture, but I've never seen anything like it. Nope, no sir. Uh, I guess it's sort of a rare sight. It's probably a jukebox. A jukebox? What's that? It's a machine that plays music selected by someone after putting some money in it. There's a stack of records inside. Records? Those things made with vinyl? I bet Mr. Jukebox is a real antique. That is correct. Oops, sorry. We didn't mean to distract you or anything. Don't worry about that. I was just about to take a break anyway. Is the jukebox broken? Yes, yeah, I can no longer find parts to fix it with. Useless products will just get thrown away. Much like this company, even if its business was founded upon the sales of jukeboxes. Huh? I thought this was a game company. You may not know, but several game companies got their start by selling jukeboxes around here. <laughs> Neptune watched the Scarlet Devil police. Yep, she did. Ah, interesting. Youths back then found the loves of their lives dancing to the music this old thing played. How romantic. It's like a musical Cupid. Right, I should get going. Feel free to stop by if you're in the mood for classic rock and roll. Okay. Of course, if this thing ever gets fixed. I'm sure it'll be right when you forget it even exists. Farewell. Oh, 45 times, guys. I bet he danced with his lover to that jukebox's music, too. <laughs> Love how the music plays for, like, one line of dialogue, and then it just, it's over. All right, we gotta find the key fragments, guys. Yeah, I kind of didn't realize there was like shit to do in Planet Tune. I kind of forgot all about Planet Tune, so it's nice to be back here again. All right, we're going exploring. 
Truth about urban legends. It's just the usual sticker picture booth, but with a surprising anti-flirt function. This is another gag cutscene. I see some lights over there. It's an arcade. No, we're not stopping. Yeah, I didn't even say anything yet, Iffy. But that thingy at the entrance. Yep, it's a sticky pick booth. Sticker pictures? Is that a couple leaving? I bet they were taking flirty pictures in it. Is there something wrong with them getting along? A poli police guy's approaching them. He's all blah 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 with the boyfriend. He's getting taken into custody. Weird. They didn't look like they were all that suspicious. Could it be? What's up with this serious business? I've heard security cameras set up at the ATMs can detect one of criminals. Oh, 46 times, yeah! Doubt that's the case here. Looks like he turned in a lost item and the owner all popped up and whatever. The lady's smiling and shaking his hand. So, you're one of them conspiracy buffs, Iffy. You like urban legends and that jazz? Ugh. <laughs> Neptune really just said, you like jazz? Oh, I keep doing that. I keep doing that by accident. Alright, mysterious vandals. Everyone passes by and watches a mysterious group of fighters on the street destroying random objects. That's gotta be a, like a Streets of Rage reference or something, I don't know. Oh, 47 times. Wow, what's happening? A barrel just flew right past my head. What the hell? What the hell is this? What the hell is this? Over there, those tough-looking people are destroying a pile of barrels. Huh? Why? Look at the other side. Those road puglists are destroying cheap, boxy cars with their bare hands. I think they're martial artists from all around the world. Oh, here comes here comes a new challenger. Oh, that's more of a Street Fighter reference than if it's from all over the world. Let's not get involved. Stop staring. Ooh, there's a cute Chinese girl with really monstrous thighs over there. Okay, definitely Street Fighter. I just told you to stop staring. Let's go. Whoa, a sumo wrestler too. I have never seen one in real life. If he's trying to her best to act like Soren. Yeah, she's putting on her best Soren impression. Uh, and lastly we have Everyone is a Master. The crew arrives at another game company storage in time to witness the masterful stacking skills of the employees. Seems we're entering an industrial district. Look, they're loading up a truck. Oh yeah, the boxes are getting moved on a conveyor belt and people are loading them onto the truck by hand. The boxes are in different shapes and each shape is a different color. It's probably tough to organize the boxes to fit neatly in the truck. Oh, 49 times? I don't know. <laughs> I heard head-crushing thighs. Yep. chun leaves in this game, apparently, canonically. Check it out, they're turning the boxes so they can stack without any gaps in between them. That's quite a skill. Oh, but they left a long, thin gap on one end of the truck. How will they fill in? If they leave it there, the other stack box are gonna get all wobbly and stuff. Hmm, a thin, long blue box is next. It, it fits perfectly. The men are high-fiving each other, saying, like, Detris. Detris? Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> Amazing! Oh, 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 oh. What? This company is the one who made the popular puzzle game with the falling objects. Ooh, I getcha. Even their loading crew are masters at it. I doubt that's got anything to do with it. Uh, one from one game reference to another. How do we go from thighs to Tetris? No, no, only in that, only in Planet Tune. Oh yeah, here we go. Planet Tune Defense Force, and I think that's everything here. Okay, <laughs> nothing here, I guess. Unless I want to go to like, I don't know, defeat five jockey. Giant Bull Awakens. You know what? Maybe we should do a dungeon here. <laughs> They're gonna reference the, the DeLorean. That'd be cool. 
All right, let's go to um, Giant Bull Awakens. <laughs> this game is really trying to get claimed. That's like the whole joke of Neptunia is that they just make ref they make, make like references to like games just for no reason. I'm gonna go this way. Well, and plus I get to hear the Planet Tune battle theme again, which is one of my favorites. Piece of cake. Oh, we haven't seen these guys in a while. It's refreshing to see some normal Neptunia enemies. Oh, these guys are really easy. Not just games, but movies and songs. Yeah. Okay, I should probably just make a beeline for the end of the, the end of the dungeon then. I'm just trying to see like if there's any dungeons worth doing. Eh, this one isn't very long. I can do this. I can tell those guys are weak if they died in like two hits. Oh, really? Really, Neptune? Oh, well, we're gonna be here for a second, guys. I'm gonna take a drink. Honestly, I don't see what's the point of having a count, like a cooldown on these moves. Boom! It really doesn't make any sense. Like, there's no reason. Imagine they reference real life events. They probably have. Wow, it's nice that Neptune's able to kill all these guys in one turn. We did it! A complete victory! I wouldn't know any off the top of my head, but I feel like that's happened before. Oh, hang on. Ready for a battle? Oh my god, look at her little face. It's so cute. We're better than this. See, now this guy is going to be pretty piss easy now. Still going to get decent experience, though. So maybe coming in here was a good idea after all. Like, I think he's gonna get 1,300 experience still. Did you think that was... Yeah, he's dead. <laughs> they referenced the airplane. Did you see me? Pretty cool, huh? Yeah, 1,300 experience. It's not bad. I love how I love how like one of the random things that just never came back is Compa's monster bell. <laughs> it's only in this game and nothing else. And I guess Neptune's hammer never came back either. That's also just like not in any other games. Let's not waste our time here too much. Yeah, easy. That was easy. It's weird how like only a couple of the enemies from this game actually ever came back in modern Neptunia. The Vaders and the Dogus are like the only ones I can really think of that came back. Ooh, this one's nice. Well, otherwise, this game has just like a shit ton of unique monsters that are only in this one game. And we gotta wait again. Maybe the hammer is a reference to Mario, I don't know. I'm a break it. Boom. Alright, let's go fight that bull. Ooh, that's a big guy. So check out this big boy. You never know, bo the bosses might be Walk miss- off. Don't waste your life. Who knows how strong this boss will be. Uh, he, he's definitely tanky.
I mean, you can't kill him in one turn, that's for sure. Alright, Kampa, can you kill this guy in one turn? I think we can. Bro's not even gonna get to attack. Yep, that was easy. <laughs> How much experience did we get for that? 800. <laughs> That's less than the rant the optional guy I fought. Yeah, it could be for Mario vs. Donkey Kong or Mario and Luigi. I don't really mind which one. Alright, that was easy. I think, or I'm pretty sure we're amazing. 2,000 credits for that. No, that was, like, pretty piss easy. Maybe I can do, like, one more dungeon and then call it a day? I don't know. Well, what's, um... What's this dungeon like? Oh, there's just a chest right here at the start. A treasure. Angel W. That's new. Ooh. That's pretty good, actually. Oh, well, kind of. It gives me defense. And it increases all of my resistances. Yeah, sure, I'll put that on. Alright, well... Before I do anything, I'm gonna save, and then we're gonna see how tough this dungeon is. And more importantly, is there anything over here? Hmm... One of these pathways takes me to the boss. I don't know which way yet, though. Plan B. Run when in danger. <laughs> Neptune seems scared of these enemies. Ow! Oh fuck! That's not good. Ah! Okay, these guys are these guys are dangerous. Oh, they, they, these are... They, how do we go from, like, piss easy dungeon to unwinnable dungeon? Okay. Believe this. <laughs> That's not good. Thankfully, I didn't softlock myself. Because I'm right, I'm right near the entrance. <laughs> so, it's okay. So that dungeon's not possible right now. It's probably one of those level 700 dungeons, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> um, okay, so... So if that's not possible, what about this one? The Neo Geo front. Whoa. Yo, this dungeon looks sick. What the hell? Never been here before. What's this? Purple pins. Oh, this is just the end? Wait. Oh, it's sector. Sector one. Hmm. All's well that ends well. Oh, this th these guys are gonna be easy, right? Yeah, okay. These guys are really weak now. So what's at the end of this dungeon, then? <laughs> 20 experience. I'm just gonna get all through all the dungeons, see which ones I can actually grind in. That's pretty much what I'm checking here. So I need to find a good grinding spot for later. Plus, this music's really nice, although you don't get to hear very much of it. Back off. Don't waste your life. I wish there was a patch for this game that made the music not reset every time. No problem at all. Come back anytime. So is there multiple sections to this dungeon, or is there just the boss just waiting at the end of this hallway? 
Oh yeah, he's right there. Okay. This guy will be easy then. I don't know. It's just... Easy. It'll be about Let's as easy. Get him in a single turn. It'll be about as easy as the um as the other thing. Blue shadow. It's, first we have black shadow, and now we have blue shadow. Yep, he's dead. <laughs> Easiest boss ever. <laughs> Wind on game industries no, this game doesn't have mods, because PS3 mod is just, like, not very popular at all. It's one of the hardest things to probably mod. We did it! Now we're top-class adventurers! Okay, well, that was easy. Um, All these easy-ass dungeons that I probably should have been doing earlier in the game. Okay, no trespassing area, deep end center, near the entrance. Neo Geo Sector 2. Obtain Ultimate Fiber 5. Let me guess, this is gonna be like really difficult. This is gonna this is gonna be the one that's really hard. Let's find out. See how tough these guys are. Okay, now these might be more. Po these might be more on my level, actually. Should have been attacking that guy. I'm not thinking about what enemies I'm targeting enough. Not yet. Oh yeah. Okay, they're pretty tough. How can they just one shot an iffy. That's really rude. Oh, fuck. I might need to get out of here. Fuck. How embarrassing. Well, crap. Hmm. I gotta find the key fragments, guys. Yeah, I want to try that one more time, actually. Then maybe this is the last. This will be the last thing I do. I'm just gonna camp out near the start of the dungeon. Woo! Maybe we can get a different loadout. I don't know. If I can get like, if I can kill one of these guys, that might be nice. Oh, there's different enemies now. Oh yeah, these guys are tanky. Also, isn't that the name of um one of the demons in SMT3? Pretty sure that is. <laughs> All right, let's uh let's defend. Ow, jeez. Not yet. I'll oh. turn the favor later. <laughs> If he is dead. Alright, maybe we can win. Just maybe. If we're lucky. Okay, maybe 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 not. It's looking a bit less likely, honestly. These are definitely later game enemies for sure. Oh, I got a guard break, though. Okay, I'm gonna defend. Bye, Compa. <laughs> yeah, we're dead. Okay. These guys are not... what. <laughs> these guys are not, um... Fucking around. Wow. Okay. Okay, uh, I think that'll be it, then, for today. Find the damn key fragments. <laughs> oh my god. Jeez. So where are we supposed to go, then? I think the only thing I can do right now in the story is beat R4. 
That's the only thing I can do right now. So, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go, um, I think I'm gonna go for today. But I am gonna do a bit of grinding off screen, and, um, I'm gonna level up a little bit so I can try and fight R4 next time. Because, personally, I would keep going, but I'm out of juice, and I'm also a little hungry. I kind of want to go make something soon. So, I'm arbitrarily stopping for today. And also because Luke pro is going to keep bugging me about when he wants to play fucking TTYD Remake. So, yeah, I'm also going to be doing that. Anyways, I will see you guys later, so take care.